Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you how you can create a simple animation by using ABC Animate, which you can find at abc.com forward slash animate.htm. Let's go ahead and get started. And we'll start by editing the background. Now, you don't have to edit the background, but I want to. And you can pick from one of these pre-made background scenes. You can draw your own, or you can upload an image to use as your background. I'm going to choose underwater. And now we see that animate that background for my animation. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the pencil tool to draw, and I'm going to draw with that not quite the smallest size, but next size up. And I'm going to, going to use the yellow color. I'm going to try to draw in a fish. Now, excuse my poor drawing skills, but this is the best thing I can do for a fish. And I'm going to change the color to draw in the mouth. Or attempt to draw in the mouth and eyeball. All right. Great. So there's my fish. As uh, unfish-like as it is, that's my representation of a fish. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add in another fish to my scene that, and so I'll have more fish appear as I go through my animation. Now to do this, I could just click on the next frame and redraw this thing, but I'm going to copy the frame. So now I'm copying this to frame number two, and I'm going to draw in a different fish. So let's pick my pencil tool and in this case, I'll make that one much larger, and I'm going to use a different color, and I'm going to have my fish come in from the other direction, as if it's trying to swallow up the smaller fish. And again, I'm going to change colors to put in a different color mouth and eyeball. So this is not an, an exercise in how to draw. Clearly. Now, I can repeat this process as many times as I want, up to 100 frames. You can see here I could also start to add in some text. I might say, these are poorly drawn fish. Now, if I want to erase something, I can use this eraser tool. If I want to insert some shapes or stamps, I can do so as well. You can also insert an image. But let's say I'm good with my animation as it is with these two frames. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play this. And I just played that one frame. Now if I go back to this one, I'll play this frame. And so now I've played frame one and frame two. We can loop these. And when I'm happy with my work, let's save it by exporting it. And we'll say we want to use half size for the sake of time. And I'll save it here on my screen. Call it animation of fish. I'll put that right on my desktop so I can find it quickly and save it. So that's how you can make a simple animation by using ABC Animate. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com and practicaledtech.com.